Welcome to the office of Hugrin Investigations. I'm Hugrin, your nomadic gamer and private investigator. Let's see if we can right some wrongs in judgment. Ah, there's food in here. Is that curry? There's a note attached to it. Uh, let's see. To Yagami-kun, I made you some curry. But I thought regular curry would be too boring, so I added some bitter melon, one of my favorite fruits. I thought that spiciness of curry and the bitterness of the melon would balance out well. Hope you enjoy. Oh, and don't hold back when sending me your feedback, either. Your honesty helps me improve. From Tomioka. Does bitter melon really go well with curry? I should heat it up and find out. Dear, this is awful. <laughs> the curious punch of ice line makes the bitter melon stand out in an adequate way. <laughs> and the vegetables aren't even fully cut. Serving this would probably violate some kind of health and safety law. Anyway, I should message Tomioko san my feedback. <laughs> you haven't tasted it yourself, have you? <laughs> Uh, let's see, would you mind chopping up the ingredients a bit more? So I tried your curry, Tomioko-san. The carrots and potatoes weren't chopped that well. I'd say focus on chopping the ingredients first, and... Oh, also, I personally prefer something with a more recognizable flavor. Alright, that should do. I mean, that's only part of it, but... Alright. But, will I always have to eat garbage like this from now on? I mean, I didn't. It didn't seem like such a bad gig at first, but after forcing this down my gullet. <sighs> well, I guess what's done is done. Hope the next one tastes at least a little better. Okay. Uh, actually, do I have any new jobs? Panty thief on the loose. <gasps> Yo. Panty thief? <laughs> and where did my jacket go? Publisher's request. All right, uh, that that's gonna have to wait for right now. I will come back to that one. Uh, okay, great. So I have one, two, three, four, four different popo records. Popo, Tenkaichi, Shichifuku, and Showa. Showa? I don't know. All right, next up, Tender. Let me out. <laughs> okay, so heading to tender. Let's see, is it this way? Did I hold down a button or did I press the joystick to run? Whoa, okay, so pressing down the joystick, that's to go first person. Ah, there it is. Is that right? R2. Okay, R2 was to run. I am not injured, which is why I don't see any health bar. Pardon me, excuse me, coming through. Pardon me, folks. I'm gonna hoop, hoop. And not this one. Next door. Hi, fellas. Nope, 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 no time. <laughs> You must be making a killing with the state this city's in. Ain't that right, Ayabe? And it's all thanks to you. Do you know anything about the Matsugane shooting last night? Not too much, no. But hey, I thought you got Higashi for all your Matsugane needs now. Word travels fast. Who told you that? Kaito. Just now. Huh? You forget how to keep a secret, Kaito-san? Or are you trying to get your buddy killed? Higashi's screwed if Hamura finds out he's been helping us. Look, man, there's no point keeping stuff from Ayabe. Better to just tell him up front than have him find out somewhere else. Oh, because he's else. a cop? What can I say? I'm a professional. Sure. Professional snitch. If the shoe fits. But sorry. I really don't have much for you today. Say what? You telling me I bought you a drink <laughs> for nothing? What? Are times too tough to buy around? Here. 
Let me at least repay you for the booze. Go on. Huh. Did you know Hamura's in hiding? He's been out of the office ever since huh. last night. Not even the cops can find the guy. Yeah, Higashi told us as much, actually. You charging us for this old news? I'm starting to wonder here. Okay, okay, fine. You want answers? Go ahead and ask. Everything's on the house for tonight. Huh, <laughs> I dug. I'd rather talk business than sit here in silence anyway. Sounds good to me. Let me think. Okay, let's see. What do I want to say? Let's go with... You know, yeah, let's ask, ask what's going on with the... Uh, Matsugane family. How are things in the Matsugane family? Well, you already know about yep. the shooting. Their hands are tied while the cops are running the show. So, yeah, they've been pretty quiet. Okay. How'd the uh, Kyori clan get to Kamurocho? Why are the Kyori and Kamurocho, Kamurocho. begin with? What's a Kansai group doing this far from home? Because they wanted turf in Tokyo. Duh. Even if it meant war with the Tojo? They couldn't have the numbers for that. True. Compared to the Tojo's 25,000, Kyore have a meager thousand huh. at most. Plus, Kamurocho is not exactly their home turf. And by that logic, they don't stand a chance. And yet they've been here almost two years now. Crazy when you think about it. Even the cops put money on the Tojo clan, crushing them into dust. So, what's the holdup then? The Kyore has the backing of the Kajihiro group. In other words, a lot of fucking money. Kajihiro? Isn't he a construction bigwig? Yep. And one of his subsidiaries is the perfect Kyore cover. I suppose you'd know it better as KJ Art. Yeah. We're Very. Familiar. That makes sense. They'd never have made inroads in Kamurocho without some big time financial backing. What does Kajihira have to do with the Kyore? Why is he funding Yakuza? Probably so he can expand East out of Kansai. The real money is out here anyway. From what I hear, he's got some big redevelopment plans for Tokyo. What kind of plans are we talking? Not a clue. But if they're coming from Kansai to do it, shit's got to be important. Look at the camera. And there's always dirty work with those kind of jobs, you know? Like what? Evictions, land sharks, laying the political groundwork. The Kyore is handling all that shit for Kajihira. At least, that's the word on the street. Yeah, thanks. These rumors of yours are going to do us a ton of good. Well, what I know for sure is that the Kajihira CEO's been up in Tokyo a lot lately. Schmoozing with politicians, government officials, even Kazumi, the head of the Ministry of Health. Why would a construction guy be talking to someone from the Health Ministry? What's the connection? Beats me. Point is, the Kyore aren't here just for Yakuza shit. It's way more complicated than mm. that. That's interesting. And how's Kamurocho been lately? How's Kamurocho seemed to you lately? Tense. And that shooting only made things worse. Nobody knows when the next fight will break out, or where a stray bullet might end up. Right. And our killer's only gone for Yakuza so far, but he could target anyone next. Gunfights? A murderer on the loose? This city's a mess. You got that right. By the way, Amara might have walked, but the cops are still pretty fixated on this multi. Even the public's wondering who will be next. Huh. Right, I'm not gonna bother asking him how it feels to be a dirty cop. That that just seems rude. It has been a time. Alright, I gotta go. Alrighty? You're a busy boy. Yeah. Kaito-san? Huh? Yagami and Kaito, yes. What an honor.
Tokyo Police. The name's Kuroiwa. Hello there, Kuroiwa. How you doing? Kuroiwa. The one who almost put Hamura behind bars. Mm. Before you two pulled him whoa, out of my whoa, grasp. Whoa, I was a lawyer. Huh. So what? I've become a department punchline now. I have you to thank. Mm, you're very welcome. <laughs> and I see you're here too, Ayabe. <laughs> oh, Kuroiwa-san. Nice nights. It's great to see you. Yeah. I cut out of work to grab a few drinks. You doing the same, Ayabe? Nah. <laughs> Old me? I don't play hooky. <laughs> well, we should be on our way. Yep. See you, buddy. Hey. Let me ask before you go. The Okubo case. You let that murderer get off scot-free. After which he burned his poor girlfriend to death. Man, everybody keeps talking about that. And yet, here we are with another murderer roaming the streets of this city. I wonder who the next victim will be. So do I. You consider that, Yagami Sensei. I constantly do. Good time. No. Yeah, I'm used to dealing with assholes. Are like you really? That. What was Kuroiwa doing there anyway? I bet he knows about Ayabi's little side gig. Probably came to keep him from chirping too much. Right. Or maybe he wanted to keep an eye on us. Hope not. I don't need that guy breathing down our necks. Anyway, you want to head home? Not yet. Something's bugging me about the Kyore clan. What do you yeah. mean? Until today, I just thought they were here scouting out some new turf in Kamurocho. But it turns out they've got a construction conglomerate behind them, and they're involved in redevelopment, too. So you want to figure out who the real Kyore is? Not a bad idea. But how are we going to investigate? You don't remember? We have a friend on the inside. <laughs> you mean Murase? Oh, yeah. Come on, let's head to KJ Art. All right then. Uh, let's see. Hi, how you doing? Gonna make a run for it. Hmm? Who wants to tussle? Who wants to tussle? You want some of this? Must we? Yeah, that's what you get. You bum. Really, guys? Let's roll, talk. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. Don't, don't square with me. Don't square with me. Okay, so let's go through here. Okay, well, right. Hey, talk. We're getting close to KJ. Right. Hey, you want to bust out the drone? See what our old friend Murase is up to? Yeah, should be pretty easy to find him this time. <laughs> right this way. <laughs> Just casually stepping on someone's car. <laughs> oh, rude. Alright, I'm gonna pick this up. And then I'll follow you up. The camera does not allow me to gaze very far. It's spy time. <laughs> okay, I'll handle the flying. You keep watch on anyone coming in or out. Actually, I think I can see... I I can see him right now, Marase. Uh, right, um... Ba -ba -ba. Thank you folks for coming by to watch my videos. It means a lot to me. 
And if you enjoyed this video and you want to support more of my content, go ahead and click that like and subscribe button. Maybe start a conversation in the comments. Now I publish content every Tuesdays and Thursdays, but if you feel like you need an extra reminder, go ahead and click that notification bell. And until next time, folks, peace.